Imagine an armored vehicle that not only protects people from bullets and explosions but also fights on the battlefield. This vehicle can be used for a variety of missions, from delivering soldiers to dangerous zones to evacuating the wounded. Today I'll tell you about one such unique armored vehicle, the RG-41. Watch until the end to learn all about the features of this powerful and versatile military machine. The RG-41 is a South African armored personnel carrier developed by Denel Vehicle Systems. It was officially introduced in 2010 at the Eurosatory Exhibition in Paris. This armored vehicle was designed to perform a wide range of tasks on the battlefield and became a response to the modern military's need for protection against mines and explosive devices, as well as for high mobility. Why do we need armored personnel carriers you may ask? On the battlefield, where explosive devices are often used and where the threat of attacks from both the ground and the air is high, armored vehicles protect people and equipment and provide the ability to maneuver even in the most challenging conditions. This is what makes the RG-41 so valuable in warfare. It protects people and allows them to perform their tasks even in the most intense combat situations. Let's take a look at the specifications of this vehicle. The RG-41 is 7.7 .7 meters long, 2.2 meters wide, and 2.3 meters high. These are fairly compact dimensions for an armored vehicle, yet it provides enough space for the crew and passengers. The weight of this armored vehicle is 30 tons, which makes it stable on the road but still fairly mobile in rough terrain. An important element of any military vehicle is its power. The RG-41 is equipped with a Deutz 2015 TCD V6 engine, which is coupled with a ZF-5 HP902 automatic transmission. This allows the vehicle to reach speeds of up to 100 km per hour, quite fast for military equipment, especially in challenging environments where mobility and the ability to quickly change position are required. Now let's talk about its protection. It's important to understand that the armored vehicle not only protects the crew from bullets but also from explosions. The vehicle's underside has a V-shaped design, which significantly increases protection against mines and improvised explosive devices IEDs. This is crucial for vehicles used in areas with a high risk of landmines and explosive attacks. Inside, the vehicle can carry 10 troops along with the crew member. But even if we consider the armored vehicle as a personnel carrier, it's important to understand that each person inside is well protected. The armor on the body, including the underside, significantly reduces the risk of injury in case of gunfire or an explosion. The RG-41 stands out for its mobility due to its unique suspension system. It's called hydropneumatic, and its main purpose is to provide smooth and safe movement across rough terrain. This is a critical feature, as warfare isn't always fought on roads, combat often takes place in deserts, forests, and mountains, where regular vehicles simply can't go. The central tire inflation system is another key feature of the RG-41. This system allows the vehicle to quickly adjust tire pressure for different conditions. For example, if you're moving through swampy terrain, you can inflate the tires for better traction. If you need to drive on solid asphalt, you can deflate them to improve road grip. Now, let's talk about the combat capabilities of the RG-41. The vehicle can be equipped with various types of weapons. The standard version comes with the TRT-25 combat module, which includes a 25mm cannon and a 7.62mm machine gun. This weapon setup is perfect for dealing with infantry and lightly armored vehicles. However, the vehicle can also be equipped with more powerful weapons such as 20mm, 30mm, or even 105mm cannons. Each weapon on the RG-41 can be used for a wide range of tasks. For example, the 25mm cannon is ideal for eliminating infantry and lightly armored vehicles, while larger cannons can be used to deal with enemy tanks and armored vehicles. It's also important to note that the weapon in the module is remotely controlled, which enhances the crew's safety by allowing them to stay inside the vehicle without exposing themselves to enemy fire. Depending on the needs of the army, 
the RG41 can be modified for various tasks. It can serve as a command vehicle, medical evacuation vehicle, infantry fighting vehicle, or even an engineering vehicle. The ability to reconfigure the vehicle makes it highly adaptable to specific missions. For both the military and law enforcement, it's not only about having powerful combat equipment, but also about its flexibility. The RG-41 is irreplaceable in this regard. It can quickly be repurposed for any task, whether it's reconnaissance, evacuation, transport, or active combat operations. The missions that the RG-41 performs range from peacekeeping to heavy combat operations. In active combat zones, this armored vehicle is indispensable. It protects personnel, facilitates transport and evacuation, and plays an active role in combat operations. This armored vehicle has proven its effectiveness in real combat situations, and today it is used not only in South Africa but also in other countries that value the RG-41's mobility, protection, and versatility. Its unique feature is that it is not just a transport vehicle but a true combat companion. As we can see, the RG-41 is a prime example of modern military technology, solving a wide range of tasks while keeping its personnel safe. If you found this vehicle interesting, subscribe to our channel, like the video, and leave a comment on which armored vehicle you like the most. We'll definitely continue to introduce you to the most interesting and important models of military equipment.